The Academy supports the IOC to pursue our overarching mission to put sport at the service of humanity. This is why when the proposal to renovate the Academy was first brought up, it took me not even a second to agree. With this renovation, we are reinvigorating the mission of the Academy giving a boost to Olympic education and setting the course for a bright future of the Olympic movement. The Academy is an international forum for free expression and exchange of ideas between people from different backgrounds in a spirit of solidarity, friendship and mutual respect. 2021 is a milestone year for the International Olympic Academy. This year marks the IOA's 60th anniversary since it began operating as an international cultural and educational center. IOA's goal has always been to preserve and disseminate the Olympic spirit, as well as to implement the educational and social principles and values of Olympism. New functional accommodation rooms new restaurant and teaching rooms, new sport facilities, replacement of all subterranean and surficial water and sewer systems with biological treatment plant. All this with no intervention with the external appearance of the premises, which maintained their historical original appearance. The rest, please move up to the steps. Can we get everybody just looking this way, please, for one moment? Just a minute. <laughs> the Academy is uh, the bridge between uh, our rich uh, past, our heritage and uh, the future. So uh, the Academy uh, should uh, work and will work uh, to carry our Olympic values into the future, to make uh, new generations familiar with these uh, values and in this way educating uh, young leaders, the next generation of leaders in sport and society. As we look back at 100 years of the EB, let us do so in the knowledge that we are only temporary trustees of this great heritage. As our predecessors have done before us, let us ensure that we continue to, con to carry this responsibility with dignity, so that we can pass on this wonderful Olympic legacy to the next generations of Olympic leaders.
Minister, Your Excellency, the President of the Hellenic President of the International Relative Truth Center, Mr. Thomas Bach. This uh, demonstrates very clearly that already in ancient times the uh, Olympic Games uh, were considered to be uh, beyond any political disputes, beyond any conflict. Otherwise uh, they could not have uh, survived for such a long time. And we could see the moment politics came into play, the Games were abolished uh, then uh, by Emperor Constantine. So it's a reminder uh, to uh, all of us that uh, the mission of uh, the Games, the raison d'etre even uh, for, for the Games, is uh, to unite uh, people and to stand uh, beyond uh, all the differences uh, we may have uh, in life otherwise.